What is going on guys? This is Richard Gaming with my review of Tokyo Ravens episode 12 and this episode it was pretty freaking good even though you know it's one of those daily life comedy episodes I actually enjoyed it quite a bit and of course you know we actually we actually learned a lot about a few characters and so it starts off with uh, Nar with Haruto and Natsume you know and anybody else they're actually going on to the training camp and we have Haruto and Natsume they are just so happy because they don't have to worry about uh, Suzuka or at least that is what they think but the way that uh, Ultima was actually talking I was kind of worried that you know something was going to happen and and that right there actually did because once they get there we actually see that the Suzuka she is there as she is there after all and I, I was wondering like why would she need to come to a training camp when she is a general but it seems that Ultimo had begged her to come but while while they were going up the steps that that had like a led to her reveal we have Koyoko that was like that was wondering where Toji was because I thought he was with them but we just didn't see him but apparently he was back in the city he was being treated by Haruto's father for this new treatment where he would actually be able to use the power of the ogre because rather than like killing off like he wants to and just banishing inside of him he's actually going to use the powers which are going to be really awesome when future fights happen because I always said that like Toji needed a power up and now that he wants to use the power inside of him he's going to be that much of a beast so I'm definitely looking forward to that but we see that for the training camp at least on the first day they, they are using these familiars for like simple tasks and I thought that the Haruto was going to use Cone because we see that right there. It's his only familiar, but he's actually able to use these like shadow people as familiars as well. So that right there was pretty cool. But it seemed him and Tema were actually struggling to make, you know, just Kuri. But uh, Koyoko and Natsume, they actually, you know, had it pretty easy because they, they, they could do it, you know, with no problem. But it seems that Natsume and her familiar, they have like such an intense bond because when the familiar had grabbed the hot pot, it actually burned uh, Natsume hands as well. And so when, when they were actually going to eat the curry, uh, Temmas and, and Haratora, you know, even though it wasn't the best, they still ate it. But then we have Suzuka who's stirring up trouble by giving Haratora this nasty soupy curry. So after they're done eating, we have we have everybody cleaning up, and Haruto we're gonna carry this pot down these steps, but he drops it, and then we see that weird third year that that that, that loves little kids, and so when, when Haruto you know actually actually tries to uh, to talk to her, she blows him off, but to get back at her, he summons Cone and stops tempting her, especially with her tail, and that's when the girl you know turns around and starts acting so friendly. And so Haruto, you know, had these questions for her about, about familiars and stuff. If it was possible to control one, you know, from, from a long distance. And she said that it is, but you have to be extremely skilled to do that. And the only person that we know that can do that is Natsume. But then we have Toji who finally appeared, and he wanted and he wanted to talk to uh, Tuzuka. And so while they talk, he actually breaks his first seal. And we see this, this eye patch appear along with these shoulder pads. And he was he was asking her if she recognized this this this, this ogre, and she called it a type of ogre, but I'm pretty sure you know it has a, a better name than that. But this ogre, it was the form that uh, what was the name? Shido, Shido Dairunji had took had, had taken two years ago. And so we we learned, and I will definitely write about this. You know how these two were like somehow related, and Shido was actually her father. So I definitely knew that, that they were related somehow, and I'm glad I was like right about that. And so it was her father that was, that was the leader. And then she also asked Toji if she like heard about this, uh, about the Twin Horn Syndicate, because they are just full of people that are like crazy about Yako. And so now, you know, Toji had this idea about a partnership where, uh, where Suzuka would actually come in and, you know, help them protect Natsume. But at the same time, Natsume will have to undergo these experiments by Suzuka. And who knows, you know, what kind of experiments she would do to her. But when Haruto, you know, heard about this deal, he quickly became defensive and wasn't going to let Natsume do it. But I'm pretty sure that she was going to accept those terms before Suzuka had changed her mind. So now we have Suzuka, excuse me, 
We have Suzuka getting jealous because she clearly likes Haratora. That right there is obvious. So she so she walks off, and now you know they're all they're wondering you know what's gonna happen next because if she gets upset, then she can make their lives you know living hell again like like she had been doing this entire time. Now 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 that she knows her secret. But when when Natsume actually goes to take a bath, Koyoko and Suzuka they go to take one as well, and Koyoko was actually you know messing with Suzuka a lot, which like really surprised me. But she was asking Suzuka questions, you know, if she liked Haratora, how she felt about Natsume, and I'm pretty sure you know they both misinterpreted what she said about Natsume because I believe she she was, she was referring to Haratora because. She didn't like the way, you know, he was defending Natsume because she got jealous because she liked him. But then the, then, then the, uh, the following day, we have uh, Natsume who's feeling down. And Toji, you know, he, he's talking to her. And then we have uh, Koyoko that, helped, that, that was talking to Haratora in private. And she was, she was actually going to tell him that Suzuka liked him. But she was like running there as fast as, as fast as she could, and she stopped them. And so, so now you know, Haratora had to explain Hokuto because uh, Suzuka did mention that he, that he uh, liked somebody before, and now you know Haratora had, had to go into detail about that. And while he was like bringing up Hokuto, we have Natsume and Toji, who who was watching, you know, from uh from 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 the from this tree. And I also forgot doing their 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 first meeting or whatever with with Suzuka. She had bought up this this uh this like large book that was like full of detail about this about this uh this raven coat because it could tell if Natsume was was really the uh the reincarnation of of Yako. And they were saying that 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 this coat it was actually kept in the uh it, it it was actually kept with with, with the mages, uh, but no, I believe it was kept with like the uh, police or something. I, I I forgot exactly where, but it was made by Rio uh, Sa Saotomi. Not sure if I'm saying that right, but it, it it was made by this guy, and so so now like nobody know where he is, but we have Otomo and we have the principal because she was like possessing one of her cats and they both and, and they both overheard you know did this meeting and when the principal actually goes to, to talk to Otomo he was saying that he heard that the coat that, that that these people have they had a fake you know a replica and the real one was, was actually kept in the school and when the principal you know actually you know asked him where he heard that at he was saying that he heard it from Sa, Sa Otomi so uh, Otomo definitely has his connection. If, if if he knew this guy personally, like maybe this will explain why he knows so much, because he he essentially knows the guy, that's like a book, that that that, that you know 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 everything. So that right there would, would definitely be pretty cool. But at the end, we we have uh, Suzuka that was actually you know gonna gonna rethink the, the partnership. So I definitely think that th that she's gonna take it. And so now you know we're at, we're at the end of the training camp and they're all going home and Natsume had, had fallen asleep, and Haratora you know he actually takes that uh that cloth or bow whatever, he takes it from Natsume's hair and he's like looking at it, and he just has this flashback of Hokuto, and he finally realized that Natsume could have been the one that was controlling her, and I'm just thinking to myself that it's about time that he realized this. Because I've been waiting for the, I've been waiting for this to happen forever. I, I'm glad it's happening now. Like now that we're at the halfway point of the anime, because it is going to be 24 episodes. It, it is about time that you know he has realized this. So I am definitely excited. I'm hoping that you know things won't won't turn out bad if he does question Natsume about this. Like hopefully you know she can explain herself. But I do wonder, you know, will this world is going anywhere even if she does confess to be Hokuto because she still has to pretend to be a guy in school. So who, who knows where, where this could go. But I am so glad that, you know, he finally realized or, or at least, you know, he's starting to realize that Hokuto was Natsume. But overall, this episode, it was definitely good. We learned so much. Like, like seeing uh, Toji... You know, un unleash that that seal and, and it transform. You know, only, only partially. That right there was definitely awesome. I definitely like how he has like these key phrases like purge and reboot. That that right there was definitely nice. 
But as always, guys, please, never, please do not forget to like the video and subscribe because that really helps me out. But as always, you guys take it easy, and I'll see you all next time.